Ah, oh, Team Lamb. Should lost. I open this? Should I open this present? Yeah. Okay. What present? It's not Naomi. beard related. No. I'm afraid. Is it moonshine? No. Oh my god, it's clothing. Oh shit. Oh shit. I don't know if it's the right size. Um, well, extra, 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 extra small. Yeah, like my. Yeah, cock. don't worry about that. Just oh, it's from Redbubble. It. Oh, yeah. it must be good. Some fucking Redbubble. Should I show everyone else first? Be exciting, wouldn't it? Yeah. Have a look. Have a look. It's not a big. It's not a picture of my own cock that you took while I was asleep, is it? That'd be terrible. Oh, <laughs> it's fucking scary, <laughs> Terry. Bitch. <laughs> oh my god. That is so good. So good. I bought a t-shirt, bitch. Oh, that's a great present, bitch. <laughs> you not in the house. Oh, can't thank hide, you. Bitch. That's right. Oh my god. I fuck. If you haven't done it, what that's from is from Rick and Morty. I fucking love Rick and Morty. It's so funny. Best TV show around. For a long time. Is either that or get the ants in his eyes. Blow oh. Or someone else. Oh. Uh, there's so many options. It took me fucking ages. That is so good. Thanks so for good. subscribing. Thanks Word for following. Of monster. Following. Subscribing and following, bro. Yeah, you can have that. Thanks. Yeah, I bought a lot of t-shirts from Red Bull. It's a good website. A lot of cool stuff in there. This is from... No, it's not actually. Top drawer. I think this is from like T-Fury or something. My brother got me this. Uh, what we're doing? Ball it's my Game of Thrones, one of my Game of Thrones t-shirts with uh, Ned Stark. Saying winter is coming. No, he's, well, sort of, yeah, he's like saying the weather and it's... Winter. It's always winter! <laughs> Good old Scene Bean. Sheena Bean. That's how we pronounce it in England, it's uh, Scene Bean. If you don't say it like that, then <laughs> we're laughing at you. Yeah, if you don't say Scene Bean, then, uh, yeah. Oh, we're doing another arty one, Yeah, we? we're going to do the Himmelstorf arty, then we're going to jump in and maybe just do a few normal platoon battles for a bit. Just slow it down a little bit. You up um, for that, keeps, keeps, Keystone? I also need to eat some food, so we'll munch on that one. What's that? Sorry? Maybe doing a platoon battle after this, just in a normal battle, rather than training room. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Sweet. We can make back some of the silver that we've lost doing this. Well, could, well, we, we could do countdowns and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to eat my Chipotle roll. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm also going to do that. Don't um, mind me, guys. <laughs> Okay, Himmelsdorf. So all Arty again, and it's Himmelsdorf this time. Yeah, oh, it's amazing. Is it good? I just saw them at the station on my way back. There's a nice little like deli, and um. Oh yeah. Was it, so it's not bin sausage rolls. No, I didn't find them in the bin. That's a shame. Delicious. More beer. I saw them from really far away. It's like they look like really good sausage rolls. They could. Oh, spicy. I mean, it's, no, fucking chipotle, mate. Here we go. Can I just say how sad I am about the uh, the new British TD line? And the, the reason is that it comes off the of Valentine, which I just absolutely hated. I, I don't hate many tanks, but I hated the Valentine. More. And I literally leapt out of my seat when I got an ace tanker badge on. Do you hate it more than the M3 and that was when I didn't play Artie. So I, I hadn't eluded it, but I did, um, or it didn't link into the bishop at that point. Regardless, I eventually had to go back and play the Valentine again uh, in order to get the bishop, because I don't like free XPing, and because yeah. I'm stubborn. Because <laughs> uh, you're tight. <laughs> that was twice. That was like the second coming of the Valentine. And then they introduce a new line coming off of the Valentine, which is just a slap in the face. And it's like 19,000 XP, almost 20,000 XP on the Valentine. Uh, so yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Wargaming. Do you know if the uh, other tanks on that line are any good? I know, uh, from what I can see, they yeah. seem to be completely different to right, I'm the actually AT playing line, this time. where it's like heavily armoured and kind of alright guns. This one seems to be more Here's my take on it. light yeah. armoured. Sorry, the Sorry, go for it. The FV uh, four zero zero five whatever is um, yeah Death Star it's not as yeah. good, clearly not as good as the proper one eighty three. But I don't think you play the one eighty three because it's a good tank. I think you play it because of the potential damage of the gun. That's true. And the the new tier ten has that in you know in droves. So yeah. it's, it's got the same exact gun, maybe even a little bit better gun handling. And I think the climb up to tier ten is is much less frustrating for people that uh, that hate immobile tanks like me. Yeah. And and I've done it, so I'm ten K XP off of the one eighty three right now. Oh nice. Uh, and wow. I found it tolerable. The the slower tanks are good. 
but they're not, you know. I feel kind of the same. I uh, really, really hate the AT series tanks, and so I, I'm pretty excited about doing the British tank storyline because I've, I've like, I've bought and resold. I think the tier six. What is it? The AT. Eight, eight, I think, I don't know, whatever the tier 6 is, I've bought and resold on about five, four or five occasions, and I'll play like one battle in it. I don't know how we're going to pour that, we might need to, this is going to be... Oh my god, it smells like varnish. It's not pretty strong. I missed. Ooh! But yeah, I, I buy that tank, I play, oh shit, I play one game in it, and then I get pissed off and sell it. It's just, so it appeals to me. I also, I mean, that's not really the main reason. The main reason... Sharp Connect. I must have said something that sounded like the word of the name of the console. <laughs> How are we gonna, why does it come in a jar? Hey, it's really red, I don't want it on my carpet. I'll run, I'm gonna go to the loo, so let me run downstairs, have a wee, and I'll uh, pour out some moonshine. Oh, it literally know. comes in it. I gotta remember that's red and not yellow. So when you come back, then my glasses fill up with yellow liquid. Treasure Eat it. Eat that eggs with your auto loader. <laughs> Eat the eggs! Um, so <laughs> I just put, if you just, yeah, it'd be fine. It'd be fine. I'm to oh, yeah, I suppose I need to, uh... You told that and just switch the camera if anyone dies, basically. Yeah, yeah. I'll be right back. Um, but what I was going to very quickly say was like, there were a couple of people on the forum. Well, it's the same sort of people who are often moan about stuff. But people were saying, oh, there's no point introducing new tier 10 that's not as good as the Death Star because why would anyone bother getting it? It's like, well, that's not why I pick tanks. I don't. If I only wanted the tank that was the best tank in the game for its tier, of each tier, then I'd only have 10 tanks in my garage. And I pick tanks because they're fun to play and I just fancy trying them out like I'm not I don't know I've got loads of tanks I don't I've got a fucking Jaegeru it's not the best tank in the game but I've got it and I take it out sometimes and it's fun and I've got a I don't know I've got a bunch of different tanks it just seemed like a silly argument to me tanks to suit your mood tanks to suit your mood I don't know you play for fun don't you you don't play it for like stats for the stats of the tank you might play it to make your own stats better to, to want to improve but <laughs> that was oh, never going to work I out. enjoy humiliating people that are playing OP tanks in an underpowered tank. And uh, you mentioned the M3 Lee. I actually love the M3 Lee. Oh. And the M3 Lee is a genuinely, like, good, very powerful tank. Well, I wouldn't say it's good. It's a powerful tank that's not good, Yeah. if that makes sense. So, like, yeah, I think that's self-explanatory. Yeah. Um, um, I'm going gonna, gonna to really quickly run to the loo for two seconds, so I'll be right back. Are you going to maybe skip to my loo? Um, I might try and skip there. Um... So everyone just kind of like, I don't know, talk among yourselves. Should I put on that like clip of the 4K subscribers video maybe? That was a pretty good clip, right? Yeah, yeah. How do I make that work? Oh, what is that? That was me doing a video update from the train station, recorded on my phone, saying like an hour before the stream, saying we'll be live right. in an hour. Yeah. Yeah, streaming. It's good, isn't it? Um, that is... Technology nowadays. Technology, eh? It's crazy. I remember to do that because I remember Ken doing that when his internet was down. He recorded something on his phone. So I was like, well, let me try that. You can upload it through the app. Anyway, highest production value Beard Guys video to date. <laughs> recorded on my phone, uploaded from the station on the way home from work. Um, yeah, let me maybe play you guys a video while um, I go off. Oh, I think Crispy Cat, who's off? Oh, Captain Badger. Thanks for watching, Captain Badger. See you later, yeah, Badge. Cool. So I think we're going to do like Platoon um, with myself, Lammy, and Keystone, and Ken will get back for a bit. And then we might do more training rooms later, but we're just going to mix up, do some normal battles. Plenty more codes to come. You guys can uh, do some normal battles as well. Earn back some of that silver you've been burning through. Um, where's the right thing? Let's see if I can make this work. Thanks for following. Thanks for following, dude. Let's have a look okay. through Ben's garage. Yeah, go for it, mate. Well, maybe you just have a browse through my garage, and I'll go and get this done. It'll be fine. You It'll can, be fine. You can comment That's the spirit. On, comment on shit. Oh, 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 don't you worry. I'll comment. Offer your opinion. Uh, the T1. Oh, you've only got 5,000 XP in the T1 now. Eat shit. What the fuck? That's not on. Right. So, uh, you say you went through the AT line, Keystone. Oh, yeah, yeah. How'd you find it? Uh, uh, well, it's an interesting story. I went up to the AT-8 and then kind of quit on it. Um, you quit? And then the on-track, if you remember, it might have been the second on-track for that line. But it, it synced up with that unlimited 24 hours of, uh, of daily doubles. And um, so I just blasted 
right through the entire line all the way up to the fully upgraded tortoise um and then probably didn't play the game for three weeks uh, oh. <laughs> but I, I i respect all of those tanks i mean none of them are uh are like really terrible the at8 stands out because it doesn't get an increase in armor even though like over the at2 it's basically an at2 with a huge frontal weak point and yeah worse armor all around and a tier higher so i think the uh, at one, like, i think the at7 has the same armor as the at2 as well but it's maybe slightly more angled at the front so it's a bit maybe deflects a few more shots but it's just that that hatch at the top that's the thing that got me it didn't my absolute not they've got you've got all this armor that everyone brags about and then you just get shot continuously in that hatch you can't sneak up on anyone it's so slow and it's just that slow tank like thing that part to be so so difficult i mean if i don't know if you play the e5 line but you learn to kind of wiggle a little bit yeah without blowing your aim up too much and the gun handling is so good on the AT series that uh, I, I didn't have a problem with it you know I just sort of wiggled between shots and, and the guns really they meet my like they're my uh, image of like a perfect gun because they fire quickly they have good solid pen and great accuracy if not incredible alpha so yeah um, you know just sort of classic British guns um, so I definitely respect it, and the tortoise is a keeper for me. Um, I've kept the tortoise. Definitely love that. It took me a oh, long yeah, time to warm to it. It 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 yeah. took me. I think once you get that top gun on it, then it's definitely a keeper. But before that, it's a bit of a grind, and oh, it did. I think all of them did my nuts in a little bit. They sent me a bit crazy. Like like you said, you have to kind of you have to be in the mood for it, and you have to get it done in one hit. Like, you, you have two or three hours to spare, you're like, oh, go on. It's, it's the same with artillery, grinding out artillery. It's something that gets done over a very, very long period of time. It's not something that you're going to really enjoy a lot. Like, a lot of tank lines that I've found, like the American light tanks, I've really, really enjoyed. Ho, ho, ho. What did you call me, you son of a bitch? Merry Moonshine. Uh, but, yeah, it's I mean, one of... I personally... I'll try and, like, play four lines at a time, you know, progressing four nice. tanks at a time, six tanks at a time, something like where I'm balancing, you know, the the, uh, the steady burn cost of, like, keeping up camouflage and all that other, <laughs> and, uh, but also having enough and getting, like, I'm just playing for the daily double, so if I play eight, ta you know, four tanks, estimating, like, even with a 50% win rate, I'm playing eight battles, ten battles, something like that, um, that's kind of where I want to be. I don't. I, I don't think playing the same tank, you know, 10, 20 battles uh, a day is like healthy. I think that's a recipe for burnout. Yeah, um, you kind of. You have done that for a while. It, but there's got to be a good reason. You end up just hating the tank. I've just uh, pinged you a. Oh, there you go. Nice. I always have notifications off, so I never know when anyone invites me to anything. Um. So yeah. Hello, on the stream. Welcome back. We've got some moonshine. Oh, Did you try any of this? I'm not surprised. It's fucking probably brutal. I'm not gonna do it all. Merry Christmas, everyone. Cheers. Oh, it's not nice. actually too bad. Oh, it's okay. It's not, it's I thought it'd be much stronger than that. It's quite drinkable. I got a little cherry in mine. No, I didn't get it. Was, it did go everywhere when I poured it. It's the worst <laughs> pouring. Why would you serve alcohol in a jar? Oh, it, it does taste like burning. It smells. <laughs> it smells worse than it tastes. Oh, look, Ken's here. Oh, sweet. Good timing, Ken. We just. Making up it's just slagging you yeah. off. Yeah. We were just listing people that we don't like. Um. <laughs> <laughs> like that, you know you're a prick. <laughs> <laughs> you're a prick Did you of onion, okay? <laughs> <laughs> when did I change clothes? I when I got home from work. In between well, this is the same clothes I was wearing at the start of the stream. I was wearing different clothes in the video earlier because I can't wear my pyjama bottoms to work, <laughs> and it, sadly... Beards, the... beards are moonshiny. Um, I've really sent you a platoon invite, Ken. I don't know if you've got notifications on. I will get one. Yeah, I got it right now. Um, real quick. Tell um, me. So you guys are trying out the moonshine? Yeah. Mm, yeah. How'd you it's... like it? Tastes like burning. It's alright, it's alright. 
Hey, um, Ian, Ian's online, Mr. Mad Hatter, should we throw him in? Get another streamer involved. Sure. Okay. Let's descend this into chaos. How do I... I'll oh, invite... Back Why to not? the, um... Tell me. The new British TDs? You know, we yes. were talking about those for a second. Yep. They are really mobile. They're turreted for the most part, except for the Tier 5. And, uh, you know, I don't know too much about them, but I did find the mobility, because so many of them are based on the Cromwell. Um, you know, you, if you're, like, if your reason for not liking the AT series is that they're, like, slow, and you just feel like sometimes the battle leaves you behind, That's the thing. Yeah. this is another option. I, I, the fuck are you, Matt? Huh? I like them for that. But it's. I can't say that they're like terribly OP. There will be some complaints that they're actually potentially a little bit underpowered. But like, get over it. There's still. Gonna be <laughs> I'm an idiot. I had him in my favorites, and I was just going hey, through. When the whole I went down that line, I don't think they were overpowered or anything. I mean, yes, they might be hard to kill, but they're like you said, they're slower to get to the battle. It's like the T95. It's it's a nasty tank, but him getting five or six kills in a battle pretty easily. I mean, that's that's very rare to see something like that happen. A lot of people I've known that have gone those lines, or even me that's gone down the British line, I mean, I was lucky if I got a couple kills, or even a couple hits on people, because it took me a while to get out there. Yeah. Well, it may be op you know, the other side of it is, it's a lot slower, you're not going to see it get into the battle as quickly. Can I turn up so, the mic volume for those guys? Um... I'm not sure I can, but I can turn down the in-game volume, and then you guys can maybe turn your audio up. Let me know. I've turned. Let me know how that is, guys. Um, I can turn down our voices a little bit. If our voices are a lot louder than theirs, let us know, and I can turn it down a tiny bit. Oh. By the way, hello everyone. Hey, hey, hey. welcome, Mr. Hey. Sorry, yeah. <laughs> welcome, How's welcome. Look doing? at this. Yeah, very well. We've got a whole. Um, I guess this is a full five-man club all gaming. Um, platoon going on right now. We're drinking moonshine. And we're drinking moonshine. <laughs> Merry Christmas. I'm jealous. Oh, that cherry's disgusting. Eat the cherry. Oh, Swallow that cherry. <laughs> mm. oh. This is quite a, quite a collection. Start well, the game. the only one breaking the SU-100 trend. <laughs> they're going to be left out. <laughs> they're going to without that tape. You're probably going to be the only ones left alive. With the AT series... <laughs> One thing I can recommend is like platoon with two other people that are also grinding out the line and are willing to grind out the entirety of the line with you and like not leave you behind or whatever. Just make a pact with two friends and then go to the same spot on the map and tear things apart. Like stay together, go in the opposite direction of all of your teammates, find a choke point and just obliterate anything that comes at you. And that's what I did. Uh, with that entire line, I went from the AT8 uh, up to the up through the tortoise with two other guys, and it was it was so much easier. And I play the tortoise by myself now, and it's like eh, you have good games, you have bad games. But I had consistently amazing games. We had an 80% win rate. Uh, oh my god! Over I don't know 80 80 battles in the tortoise. So you're waiting for, so you get in a position and you're waiting for the battle to basically come to you and then you're kind of picking people off. Is that what you're kind of... No. We oh. look at the weakest flank and go at that flank. Or we look okay. at the ground we wanted and we'd go, like, this is a tough map, but I mean, we might go down on the water side. We might follow the train track. Um, it would all depend. Uh, okay. But we'd stay together and we would just keep rolling forward. Um, yeah. The biggest thing I remember with grinding that line was is once you go that Bombs direction, it. no matter what, you don't turn around. Otherwise, it'll just be for nothing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Whatever direction you start going, that's where you're going. What, what are you feeling, like guys? I can, I'll can. i head down towards the town, because that's where I can see uh, Keystone and Ian going. So let's go down there. Okay. okay. Or maybe, I mean, we could split up, to be fair. Yeah, I mean, if come we're going to leave a flank open, we don't want to do that. That's okay. Ken, come with me. I'll we come can, back. We can definitely I mean, cover this. Come on, baby. Yeah. We yeah, we're, we're, wherever we're, you guys we're fast go. enough to turn around. Yeah, yeah. Necessary. Yeah, I think you guys know we've got a pretty good split. If you guys go that way, we'll go this way. I've got my, my excellent cherry, cherry, too much. It's a very long cherry. It is a very long, weird cherry. Um, that looks yeah, a lot it's like probably a as pepper. spicy as the one I just ate. And also the very important, no smoking sign. No smoking on the SU-100Y. Oh, yeah. I don't know where to go, Ken. Uh, here? All right, no, Liam. I was going to come up on your right side. And I, I missed the uh, spot. Yeah, I think we'll just we'll just camp back here. Uh, but no, we'll I do agree. a countdown I, for the next I battle as well, guys. You. By the way, 
that's something that me and my dad usually do most of the time, especially in a line we don't know anything about, or if it's a tank we've seen in a battle and it's, if it's by itself, it's very easy to kill. You know, if you see AT out there, I can get around it pretty quickly and most of my tanks and kill it. Uh, yeah. But when they have buddies that are playing the same tank or have support, I mean, they're just devastating when they have that support system. And that's really what you need to do in this game is, is if you're having a hard time with the tank, get your buddies out there to help you. Um, yeah. You know, that's yeah, a definitely. great way to get up a line quick is having people helping you out. Up to a point, and so the reason I said two people is like, I'll find that in a five man oh. platoon, my average XP actually goes down. Um, mm -hmm. Just well, because I play with, you know, I play with Unicum, so there isn't, there's just a lot less XP to go around. Oh my god, <laughs> you just smashed me there, fuck. Wow. Yes, I agree. I mean, I, I think having a small platoon is one of the best ways to go. Yeah, I was, I was sticking with three man as well can often work quite well because four man and five man platoons you get against other four man or five man, which isn't necessarily always bad because you can. There's just as good a chance Ooh. you're going to come against a five man platoon of average guys than good guys. To be fair, but, um, I just got really ra badly wrecked straight away. <laughs> oh my yeah, god! I, I did too. I fired a snapshot. I tracked someone, and then I died. <laughs> Thanks for following. There's just a hail of artillery fire. That's fine. I'm going to keep doing what I was doing, which was typing out these PC codes, so we can just start throwing them into chat, maybe. Snapshot. Um, I died. Uh, PC codes. Uh, okay. I've got some from left over from packs. I've got a load of these cards, which are double sided. They had the RAM two codes oh, on that we okay. had, but um, they also have PC yeah, code on the back. Yeah. Mind. You get a three days premium, 100,000 credits, and a T2 LT. And they all expire end of the year, so we've got to give them all out. You also have to yeah, submit... some of those at uh, the Chicago thing, too. Yeah, too. yeah, it's like their um, kind of out. exhibition uh, things. <laughs> An exhibition show. Yeah. Keystone, I have to say, you look amazing with that camo scheme and the water that you were going through. It looks amazing. It looks really good. Oh, oh yeah, the Fury. my Fury. I just completely rage quit. No mind. Oh, let me rage quit. I got salty and I left. <laughs> it's the moonshine in me. You've had too much moonshine, Lamb. Easy back, easy back. I'll start yee hawing in a minute. Ah, uh, you know. It's still like 12 o'clock here. I can start drinking. <laughs> yeah, forget it. Like, we can all get salty. <laughs> West Coast America is like lunchtime at the moment. We're like, wee! Merry Christmas, wee! Oh no, this is bad for Keystone. Oh, we don't like to see that. Riggedy, riggedy, wrecked. Come on, Mr. Hatter. You got this. You guys ready for the biggest YOLO flank of all time? <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. Now, for Rico, Thanks, fallen, fallen. he's probably listening to this, but he's right there. and uh, Or thereabouts, he was. Make sure you yeah. fuck him he in? He's in a said? butt, I think. I'll he? ping it again. He was right around there. Is that the butt? was he in? Oh, oh he's burnt. in the burnt. Alright, yeah. dirty birdie. Hey, Bert. I never just, spotted we'll just... him, but I figured out his trajectory. Ha! <laughs> so, we'll Some do. science we'll going on possibly here. Go wrong. That's just probably more maths. With trajectory. Science, bitch! Yo, <laughs> bitch! Science, yo! Um, oh, hello. Oh, God, when's the next, um. Uh, what was the other series? The other. Fucking. Better Call Saul. Better Call Saul, when's that shit coming back out? Yeah, that's that kind of stopped abruptly, didn't it? That's been ages ago. It's maybe sad. Mm. I thought he was going to bust that out for Christmas. Oh, oh lucky dude. Rip. Rip. What I remember is they shot a Rip. pilot season, you know, 12 episodes, whatever, and then uh, it was popular just from the like the first episode. They were immediately, so the season as is kind of the the way now, but I, you know. It'll be back. Oh, our, I think it's crossed. Bulldogs AFK. Well, hopefully they just take the time. Lamb, when you got salty, Lamb, when you got salty, I was just thinking right off the bat, you guys on the Sims, and you kicked. Oh my first god! <laughs> just, <I couldn't>... Such <laughs> good news. That couldn't have. That couldn't have started better. <laughs> it was just kick the shit that out of that thing. Best. I'm glad you enjoyed it. <laughs> 
Mm-hmm. It's one of those series. Oh, and then when you said baby on board. <laughs> oh. oh. Thanks, Abby Cap. Where, uh, Thanks, Abby Cap. Oh. Merry Christmas, beards. Monty, you're terrible. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's another very English reference. Scrubbers! Oh my <laughs> Scrubbers! They're throwing themselves into the road gladly! Oh, great film. With Nail and I. Watch it. That's a Christmas. Uh, very Christmassy. There you go. I'm going to put some stick. I'm going to shush up your controller. Thank you very much. Very, very kind. Make it very festive. There you I'm go. Sticking shit on my shit. No. Okay. No. I'm nearly finished typing out all these codes. Oh my god! So they're, nice. all, they're all like oh, oh, it's a Ken. Oh my god! What we got here? You dirty birdie! Look at filthy, that. filthy. Do you, well, I don't know if we need to do countdowns because everyone's like just getting in the same game anyway. So um, do you think we should give them a little countdown? Batch, yeah, yeah. every other. We we'll do every right. other. <laughs> uh, anyway, you can have that on there. I'm just sticking stickers <laughs> everywhere. Get on the back of the van. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, so many good wind down <laughs> quotes. Get in the back of the van. <laughs> uh, well, he's, I think it's just the bit where he's rubbing deep heat on himself to keep himself warm. <laughs> it's like, oh my god, he's fucking nutcase. It's called this the Campbell carrot. Because I invented it in Campbellwell. <laughs> and it's shaped like a carrot. <laughs> <laughs> uh, god. Anyway. Anyway. Back to tanks. Tanky, tanky, tanky. Tanky twos. Oh my god, the tier tens have just filled up quite nicely. Holy shit. This is why I didn't feel that bad when I went on stream. Well, went on Quickie Baby when he in, got on a battle with him when he was streaming and wrecked him in my bat chat because um, that's pretty much how Ooh. every stream is for me. <laughs> just getting wrecked by people I know. Yeah. Oh. He took it well. Countdowns are a beautiful thing. I think yeah. he's hunting me. We started like, we tend to do like, we'll alternate, do like a countdown and then non countdown. Or if I'm playing, normally I won't count down. If I'm playing like a light tank or a kind of campy TD, because I don't want to be sitting still for too long in case. Like, everyone's been pretty good. I've rarely yeah. been like really badly stream sniped. But even just because people, when you do get spotted, they'd be like, I want to shoot Ben, I want to shoot Lamb. And... They never want to shoot me, that's a lie. <laughs> <laughs> nah. No, 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 no. I'm, getting, I'm getting to uh, try to catch up to you guys. I got me a bottle of Jack Daniels. Nice. Oh, and, GG. Uh, so I will drink some of this right now, but whenever you guys get a donation, I will do a shot. Oh, wow, oh snap. Do a shot. So every time there's a donation, it's got to be at least five pounds. I'd like to do like one pound for every oh, penny. Man, I was going to say, <laughs> that's a one pound. This is going to be real in a second. <laughs> All right. Remember, 10% of those donations go to charity as well. I was well. also going to say, I was thinking about work today. For the, I don't know, yeah. whatever, the temp, so 10% of the donations on Twitch go to, our ones go to, donate, go to Help the Heroes at the moment anyway, which is a charity of helping uh, sort of injured veterans and their families and that kind of thing, which is a great UK-based charity that sort of thing. I think tonight I'm also gonna I'll, I'll match those 10 percent cuts from my own pocket as well so and it's only like a few quid but it all adds up so I don't know what 10 is a quid oh, I'll double awesome. that to, to two quid sounds good just to get us I'm kicked over because we're nearly at that um we're nearly over that hundred quid mark on the charity pot so we'll do that and then I'll make the I'll make the um the big payout to them in the morning or tonight or well, probably in the morning so I'll be drunk tonight. <laughs> so being drunk and early in the morning is not a good time to make donations to charity. Yeah. I'll tell you that for nothing. Yeah. We'll go and get one uh, of those we're gonna get one of those big novelty right. cardboard checks for like a hundred pounds. <laughs> Take it down to their head <laughs> office on Christmas Eve. With a bell Ding, 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 ding. We're not open. <laughs> the beard oh God, guys I, are coming. I actually put binoculars on my bat chat. And that was an experimental move. I don't think I've driven it so since Keystone, then. I guess you want me to watch your back. When That's you exactly it. And the okay. chat channel was, uh, you know, filled up. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, yeah. It'll be fine. Whoa! Oh, my God, yeah. It's pretty light your end, isn't it? Jesus. I might come over there. Oh, God, that was close. There's a big pile on there. Lovely, lovely moonshine. Little cough for Jesus. feels very naked here. I, I oh, know, are you I, naked? I, I understand you're coming on that one. 
I am in fact me. <laughs> that, that would explain it. Well, it I mean, sounds like you're getting in the spirit to me. I've got a very analytical mind, you see. I'm good at processing these things. <laughs> very literal. <laughs> oh, I'm spotted. I'm feeling their team's gonna are gonna play this smart. It's gonna be a good battle. Just the way that we haven't spotted anybody. Yeah. Waffles on the left. I don't recognize any names really. Um, I think a lot of people got Corellia by the sound of what I saw in chat. Dragon Ridge, Corellia, Dragon, Wine Park, yeah. So everyone else has got into games together, just not with us by the look of it. Ooh, we're gonna sneak across, kick the fingers. Cool. Oh. Oh. He did it, he did it. Yeah, it does seem very cool. Oh! Waffles sitting down this road somewhere. It's a bat trap. I found a bat trap. In the town. Cool. Oh, he's dead. Ooh, he's gone. Here, <laughs> One it? shot. Oh, nice, nice. You got the bat chat down. Yeah. Good work. Um, that was. Yeah, none of those this, guys are very easy to hit. This bulldog's gonna get fucked up. Nice one, Keystone! Uh, I'm not sure that this is going to be a good trade. If I get hit just to kill a well, nearly dead... How about I oh charge in? God. How about I charge in up to that ridge? Because there's no one here. Fuck it. I'm, gonna... I'm not lit yet, so... Oh, I okay, I'm, yeah, I'm going to charge up to there because as soon as I get in close to it, then they won't be able to hit me anyway. There's no one there. They would have this spotted me by now, surely. They're all in the town. Look how many. Check. Look how many, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's sweep around. Let's cut hard. Diagonally across the map. I'm, this I'm just going to check for RT like, as well, but you go and die. Yeah, yeah. You're faster. I wish that the radial had like a tempo, um, like uh, some way to go, like rush or slow it down. Um, yeah, it's a, good, it's a good shout. A better command system, yeah. It, it would I would quite like one that said thanks, I think would be useful, and maybe one that says like fuck off. That'd probably be pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I God, say, I damn it. <laughs> oh, no. I mean, I think I'd use both of those. I know you're kind of kidding. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah. yeah. I know you're kind of kidding with that. There's a lot of redundancy in the. In Thanks the would be good. Menu. But so awesome or GG. Anything yeah. with a thumbs up works, right? Like, yeah, yeah. But. Oh, uh, what? You know, there's so yeah. much redundancy. I'm dead. Crushing us. I'm glad we don't have friendly fire. I mean, we probably. I mean, quick capping enemy. probably would have been a, like the. The kind of game winning option, but I don't like doing that. Oh, I'm gonna. Right. Go on, Benjamin. We might want to go for it. Might be worth nice. doing. Might be worth getting someone on the cap, but. Our E100 is going to. You might want to help him out. Yeah. I mean, if we're going to be capped. We're gonna. Right? Yeah. I'm gonna go and get on the cap and force yeah, them to come back. Town except for their we haven't done fuck all, but we need to I mean, try and. I want to try and win, so. Fuck yeah. it. I'd rather win than do a bit more damage and lose, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, it just it is what it is. Yeah. Right? Like, if we all three get on, it's a fast I don't think the E100 fancies it. He's, uh, he's not too keen. Well, as long as we all have a very nice time. That's the main and thing. And make lots of friends, then uh, uh, that's the main thing. Traffic. Right. Got lots of <laughs> That's definitely a way to make friends. Yeah. Get lots of get, get lots of pay cash. <laughs> 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 no, well, fuck it. If your if your team goes like fucking <laughs> lemming train down one side and you murder everyone, then you deserve to get like quick cap. That's how it goes. You leave a whole flank open. You get fucking quick cap. Right. Ha! Frying for our cap yet. So well, they can't. They're just they're they stuck. Just they're immobile, and they didn't protect their flank. So fuck you! You got really wet. Oh my god! The M he hit me with oh, a blind that shot. That reset. Yeah, though. that's all right. <laughs> oh, that's all right. He can't reload before we cap. So. That was a fucking there. nice shot to hit me though. Nice shot. Not the way I want to win, but a win is better yeah. than yeah. not a win. Wow, I, oh, I must have got a special op for that, because I got 100 grand for doing 700 damage. Oh, there we go, I got 75,000 silver from that Winter Warfare. There you go. Nice. You know, fuck it. Woo. We won. Oh, exactly. Had to in the top three. I'll tell, you, I'll tell you what, the guys on our team that did a lot See you later, Quinny. Are happy that we won. <laughs> it was yeah, exactly. Like, than yeah. losing and being dead. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. 
good way of looking at it. Um, okay, what's here? Eight. Maybe, let's go for eight, yeah, because I can. I'm actually trying to level up my Borsig, aren't I? So, I'm going my T34. Let me change up my ups a little bit. Is my... There you are. There we go. Oh, look at this. T34, IS3, KV4. Lovely stuff. Right. Um, so does anyone in chat play Water Tanks PC and would want a Water Tanks PC code that will give you three days premium, a T2 LT tank, and 100,000 credits? I'm guessing PC works the same, whereas if you already have that tank, you get the gold equivalent. I don't if know. you do, come on down to Beard Town. Just shout out, do like an at the Beard guys in chat, and I'll just send you a code for the PC version of the game. I've already saved one for Jack, so don't worry, oh. Jack. I've got you one. Mm, that's disgusting. <laughs> and I'll just send you a code. Oh, for the PC. oh sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry for the feedback. So do do an app from now, so I see, okay. Dodger Jam, I see. We've got so many of these to give out. I'm gonna do this for a few of them. <coughs> and then I'm gonna uh we'll do some competitions for the next. Nice. So Dodger so Jam. Do any of you guys plan on getting the uh the concept or the scorpion when it comes out? I think, I think I'm gonna get the scorpion, that looks like I was thinking something about I'd scorpion. enjoy. Dodger focus. Yeah, I was planning on getting the scorpion too. Depends on how much it is. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. And if it gets yeah. prem matchmaking or not, because it doesn't on PC, right? They're a bit more stingy it on doesn't. that sort of thing, right? I haven't really looked into the tank that much, so does anyone have like a rundown of what it's like or anything? An E25. Like, I can tell you. It's like an <laughs> E25 with absolutely no armor, so you know, you're never going to bounce a shot, but it has a, sl it has a more powerful gun. Um, okay. So that's kind of the way to think of it. Like good mobility, good camo, um, but a very a very glass cannon. So I'm gonna go zero line. Okay, there we go. I just gave out like five yeah. PC guys. I'll play a game for a bit and then we'll come back and do some more. Oh, holy matchmaking! <laughs> yep, I'm going uh, yeah, zero it's, line. It's basically American T E25, from what I understand. Just it's a little harder. I'll come over with um, but with the important and distinction land. Distinction that like the E25, you know, it can get right up next to something and it'll. You will occasionally bounce a shot from you okay. know, even a, a powerful gun. If it catches the angle, um, right? Yeah. It's not happening with the Scorpion. Okay. And it's got a cool name as well. It so just looks weird as well. I'm really, I'm a sucker for tanks that look weird. Because I've played the game for so long now, and there's so many tanks in it that a lot of them I'm like, eh, it's just another tank. It's got a gun, it's got tracks. Like, I don't know, I don't get as excited about new tanks I used to. But when they're like weird looking, yeah. then I I like that. Like yeah, when they're like know. unique in some way. Like the yeah. the box tank and like I don't know the KV five I quite like because it's just silly and silly silly, silly Ram tanks. Ram yeah, Ram Panzer. <laughs> I love the Ram Panzer. Keystone, G20 welcome to you. Concept looks really uh, really silly, but I really haven't really heard too many good things about that one yet. I don't really know much about it. It's so very weird looking. Do you talk play too much in your stream, or do you just kind of play? And, um, like, do you talk about what's going on? Presently? Yeah, a little bit. We so we have uh, we have like the these battle beard series, which is me and Lamb just kind of playing platooning, and that's more like kind of just talking shit and occasionally a bit of vague tactics, but generally just a bit of like normal platoon chatter. And then when I do like solo commentaries on like good games that I've had, then those are a bit more like tactical. So like, oh, this is why I did this and this is why I did that. Like I don't go into super detail of like, I don't know, the numbers and stuff, maybe like Jingles and Quickie Baby do so much. But um, but yeah, it's more of a, they're more of a kind of like tactical thing than a, oh my God, I owned this guy sort of thing. And that's intentional really. So the, um, we can keep the Battlebeard stuff being like fun and lighthearted for people who just want to watch a bit of decent, all right gameplay or unpredictable We're talking about gameplay. Amazing. <laughs> <laughs> amazing. And, and, a, and a bit of banter. And then there's the solo commentaries are more like if you want to kind of learn to play. The a reason tank. I asked is because, well, the, the stream can't really see it, but there's. A, so I'm in a sniping position, and our tier seven heavy, our T29, is pulling up in front of me. 
you know, it's no idea. To snipe from my position, which is his business, except for the fact that he's not camoed, and so he's getting me shot at. Uh, oh, C twenty eight on the right. Don't do that shit. <laughs> I know what you're talking about. Son of a you're bitch. Like, oh, so I'm trying oh, to help get here, and I can't because I had to. <sighs> Thank you, mediums, for backing me up. You guys ran away like little pricks. <laughs> 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 I was, but. we were pushing nice through there, and then as soon as they started seeing the heavy tanks and everything coming around, they left me. Eat and shit. I, well, I can find that, mate. so much, but eventually they're gonna get me, and they did. How are we getting on? We're doing pretty well. The amount of times I've been tracked this game is ridiculous. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> tracked so much. Oh, there's an artillery. Oh, there's quite a lot of them down here, fuck. Nice. Yes, it did. Oh my god, okay. Ooh. Ooh there we go. Boom. The other one. <laughs> Boom, shake the room. <laughs> Trying to get behind that corpse there before they can right. shoot me. Hopefully he's watching my back. Excellent. KV3. Yep, he's a one shot. He's, oh, we almost got artillery then. You got two seconds. There you go, nice. Nice. There's an artillery coming oh, up behind me as well. And a TD oh, no, sort of. Dead. Oh, it's the E25 still alive. <laughs> Don't mind me, Liam. I'm just making a barbecue over here. Don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> what are you up to? What's going There's on? Barbecue going on. You cooking things up? You stirring the pot? Bum, bum, ba -da, ba -da, bum. Mm -hmm. Um, who's in chat? Jack. You're a mod who can post links. Would you mind doing, if you're near a keyboard, could you do me a massive favor and just like dig out uh, the link to Ken's YouTube channel and also to uh, the Talking Tanks podcast for Keystone's podcast and post those in the chat, please? That'd be swell. If you're not near a keyboard, don't worry, I'll, um, I'll sort it out when I'm being less lazy. <laughs> Fuck you, eat. Oh, <laughs> nice. Oh, you just gave him a heart attack. He probably didn't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Holy crap. The f***ing sick. And a T-34. Thanks, Jack. Man, this is a relatively good time, too. Fuck, 3,300 damage. <laughs> oh, man. Reaper, what's that? That's nice. Killing people in a row with one shell. Okay. So, one so shot. stealing kills. Mm, potentially, or do yeah. 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 Or if you're like, yeah, Reaper. Yeah. <laughs> Reaper. Yeah. <laughs> Reaper, yeah. No, I did. Didn't do too well that time. Uh, oh, I okay. only need like 10k XP to get the next tank on that line. Excellent. That's good to know. But let's, I'm gonna keep mixing up. Um, any preferences, guys? Tanks you want to take out? I'm trying to think what I might have that might be fun. Lammy, any thoughts? Can do a five-man platoon of that that new tier one. Yeah. Oh my god, yeah. Go okay. Yeah. I was tempted. Do you think matchmaking will work though? Why not wait till we get another tier? I don't. I don't think we should. <laughs> we'll do it once. Come on, guys. One, one time, one time. This isn't. This isn't seal clubbing. This is entertainment. For okay. the masses. It's Christmas. <laughs> yeah, exactly. This is what people donate for. Look, <laughs> look, you know, okay, look, so when, <laughs> when like, Russell Crowe goes off to, like, see starving kids in Africa, he goes there, and he still has some lunch when he's there, and it's not a bad thing. You don't be like, oh, fuck you, Russell Crowe, you're having some lunch, we're in Africa, there's all these starving kids. <laughs> we're like that, we're not, we're just coming down to check it out, we're just having a little game, and then we're walking away. We're just Russell Crowe eating a oh, ham yeah, sandwich in, in Africa. Ammo because we can't. <laughs> Countdown. You understand we can't put any equipment on this tank. I hadn't even. I hadn't to. tried. I'm just because because I'm not a dirty steel. I'm not a dirty seal club oh, again. <laughs> Alright, I'm ready. It's always a sad day when you can't put octane in your tank. <laughs> <laughs> right, we're doing a countdown for this? You don't need to count down. How big is the fucking cube, <laughs> guys? Like, work it out. <laughs> we'll get put in a tier 2 game anyway, probably. It's going to be insane. Which would be the fairest thing. Imagine. Imagine if just... Province. It's going to be like 5 versus 7. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We're, we're 5 of the 6. Two ones up there we go. <laughs> a couple more. 
<laughs> They're all coming in now. Uh. But this thing, they did hit it with the nerf stick, like again and again and again. So it looks like it's you know a tier six, tier seven, but it's actually paper thin armor, not a Thank true you, seventy six millimeter. It does not overmatch. It, so it can bounce off other tier ones, um, and you know it doesn't have a huge health pool. It's it's not out of balance. It looks like it would be, but it's not. It's I think a, a, it's just. Don't you hate that? When you get a premium tank, like okay, the the SU100Y, <laughs> once you see 130 millimeter on there, you're like, oh, I'm gonna do so much pen and damage, and then you're like, eh. I mean, it's still a good amount, but 130, come on, we should be able to do a lot more pen than that, but they nerf it down. What's the alpha on that thing though? It's huge. It's 490, isn't it? On which tank, sorry? Yeah, but still. Oh, hey, that 100 quad. Oh come on. All right. 490 it's alpha. Pretty, in the it's like a JV2 that can aim. <laughs> With, a, with the mobility of a medium. Come on. There's only sniper. We all want more. Okay. They haven't got a platoon. We're oh gonna... my god, we're gonna fucking destroy him. To be fair, all these other people could be stream right. people. Oh my god. <laughs> and our two light tanks aren't moving. Guys, so let's just all right. let's all vow now that we will never do this again, okay? We all everyone promise. So next game. <laughs> Next game, we'll put equipment on. <laughs> <laughs> Camo. We'll, uh, premium consumables. <laughs> it says so I'm going 40 kilometers an hour, and it does not feel like it. This thing's massive. No, it, it feels like it's slow. <laughs> it feels so slow, man. There's no, there's no premium ammo option with this tank, and you can't mount nope. equipment on it. Uh, I don't know why. So... Because it's, and it's not a premium tank, tank, so you yeah, can't, you can't throw any anything. old crew in it. It's also one no, silver per round, round, which I thought was quite it's nice. It's pretty cheap, yeah. <laughs> it's pretty cheap to use. I mean, it's a tier one tank. It just doesn't look like it. It looks like a normal tank. I think that's, what, that's why they put it in, for for new players yeah, to like, have them a bit it. more fun, which I think is understandable. I don't know how much effect that would have, but I, I hope it works, because obviously more players is good for everyone, even if they are, take a while to learn the game, you know? Like, more player base is good for the game. It's too much more fun for younger players, yeah. When you have assholes like hey, <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to World of Tanks, <laughs> bitch! Bro, all we're doing is doing what we were talking about earlier. We're all struggling with the tier ones. So we got some friends together, and we're just in, you know? Yeah, this grind is really yeah, tough, you know, man. I'm really struggling oh to get Oh my god, the... this thing hits so hard. I'm just chugging in. <laughs> I'm... But you can do over. this same thing with any of the tier ones. I mean, quite frankly, like, the, the British, the medium one, is actually the most OP tier one. It can actually one shot most of the things that it sees. I find I'm personally I think the T like so what I was going to say earlier is that it doesn't matter if there's an OP tank at tier one because everyone who's normally playing it is just going to be bad anyway, and so it makes no difference. Like they're putting me driving the wrong way or looking the wrong way or firing the gun the wrong way, and it's like it doesn't matter what the difference in stats are. They're all going to be terribly bad apart from the seal clubbers. I think Shout out personally, to the I like the uh, the T1 Cunning. I think is the best because it can clip anything basically. It can like one clip anything. I haven't even fucking seen anyone to shoot at. There we go. Hello. I oh, know I bounced all but one of his shells, and what shows the one that? Well, I'm just. I just bounced a shot Sorry. from the FT. I'm taking these to town. Oh. There he goes. But you're right. Like the thing is, you download the game, you see an image of the tiger, you're thinking M4 Sherman, you're thinking tiger. You might be, I mean, yeah. you might be thinking T-34 if you've got familiarity with Russian tanks. And then you've got to play, what, like, you've got to play through these interwar tanks for, like, three tiers. Yeah. And it seems like a little bit of a bait and switch. And this guy's going to ram me. Oh, he does. More people than should is they buy, you know, a tier 6 or they buy a tier 8 premium. And it's just, uh... Woo! You know, you we won! Go us! Yeah. I don't think I, you should I, buy I, a premium tank unless you've gotten to that tier naturally. And even then, I'd be cool. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Now. Unless the Ram Panther comes on yeah. sale, then you should just buy it regardless. <laughs> oh, so yeah, bad. don't play it though. Yeah, <laughs> we, we fucking own those That's all you play, sell all your tanks and play only Ram Panther. 24 <laughs> 7. Okay, that you know, was not what... fun. Yeah, that was, um, that was pretty boring actually, but. There we go, we took it for a run. We can um, say we did one it. One of the things I hate when people ask me, like, what, what premium tank should I get? Okay, well, what style of tank do you like? Well, I just started the game. Well, play a couple of different things. Uh, artillery, play tank destroyers, play heavy tanks. Play the game for a while, 
because you don't want to buy a premium tank that you're just going to take out and just yeah. die all the time because you don't understand how that tank works. You know, so. Even if that's the case, like even if you're going to die, you, you don't want to play a tank that you don't enjoy like everything about Thanks, it. Thanks, Jack. You know, I mean, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, yeah. pick something that you like. I like heavy tanks and tank destroyers. You know, I do buy medium premium tanks like I have here, but that's just because I collect them. You know, but if I want something that I'm going to sit there and grind uh, and get silver and experience points, I'm going to use like a heavy tank for my tank destroyers because I know I'm going to get tons of silver and experience points from it. Um, we will count down. Yeah, we'll count down. Oh. Does yeah. anyone know anything about that uh, that free tank that we're getting tomorrow? No. Word on the street oh, is that it's it. it. Well, what I've, I don't know anything firsthand. PC got it uh, last year, so you can find a lot of YouTube reviews. Uh, I haven't heard great things about it, so you know whatever. And again, it's a free premium. If you sell it and take the garage slot, that's your business. Or if you keep it. For whatever reason, I wouldn't get rid of it until you played it a couple times. Or... <laughs> I know I like collecting the little tier twos that they give us for free. Apparently, it's got uh, yeah, it's well, 17 to 29 armor pounds. Toss it asunder. And 8 to 14 damage, so it's like PZ1C bajillion shots per minute auto loader. Looks like something like that. Mm. Oh, Lego's in the same one. But you never know. It it sucks when it comes out and then they end up buffing it like the T7 clown car. You know, it's. Yeah. Oh, I love that thing. I think it's so much fun. <laughs> I, I can, hate um, it, but I didn't sell it. If I can quickly interject, we've uh, so Jack the Ripper, thank you very much. You very kindly posted uh, like the various social links for the uh, our fellow dudes in the uh, in the party in platoon today. So we've got the links for for Keystone's uh, podcast. We got we got Ian's channel up there, and we've got Ken's channel up there. Oh, well, thank, thank you, guys. you. And um, you. so go and check those out. Yeah. They're all very cool guys. Do a lot of very good content. Um, Jack said he couldn't find your private cam channel. <laughs> 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 your, <laughs> you look, have, oh, if you oh look God. into the <laughs> look at you on the <laughs> camera, you look ridiculous. <laughs> oh my God, we are up to to the corner. Na Lamb, you look amazing. Thank you. <laughs> you, look, you look amazing. You look so good. This I thing think smells think like shit. The, uh, the T14 Churchill 3 or T1. I don't think we even have to stop moving. We can <laughs> go just about every yep. time we see it here. <laughs> Fucking game now, on. Now, two of you are underdressed. <laughs> 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 Not okay. You know, they do put camo on sale, boys. <laughs> You know, I just haven't gone back through like, ah! all my premium tanks set up. Sorry. There we go. Ah! Ken's got the flank going on. Watch out, there's a T-34 coming around behind us. Ish. Oh, I bounced him. T-1 heavy. Let's focus him down. Oh, watch out. There's quite a few of them over here. I'm pushing over on Tim. And I've Ooh. killed him. Watch out behind you, yeah. There's a Marauder behind you. Yeah. He's dead. Marty's yeah. looking this way as well. He's gone. Ah! I'm getting artillery! That's right. Oh, look at these rams lining up here, Gordon. <laughs> look at them run. Here. Love me, Ken. <laughs> Hug me. I'm trying to help Ken. Oh my god, that was just the most <laughs> relentless ram I've seen. <laughs> it's like 200 <laughs> meter ram. Hey, yeah, Bishop. I need some help. Oh god. I'm coming to you. I'm getting hit in the bomb. Back up at all. Keep back. There we go, Kill Ken. Kill the bishop before he hits me. Oh. Wow. Who's I'm left? Oh, there's two heavy no, binders. I haven't even seen. Okay, let's get rid of the RT and then we'll turn around and get those heavies. Oh, I'm dead. You're dead. VK. Heavy. Turret, 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 oh, shit, there's a tank destroyer. Oh, no, I died. Oh, I didn't even see. Didn't even see him there. Go on, Ken. Okay, well, who, so we got the uh, the 47R, the girls, and the mad are all left to uh, to take this one. I think we've probably got this one in the bag, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I'll point something out here, though, for those that are watching. So Ken and I were taking on the KV-220, and I actually I own a KV-220, 
but I didn't look at what tank it was. I just saw a KB-1 in silhouette, and it, I was aiming for his hull and bouncing. I bounced like three yep. rounds before I, I realized, oh, that's a KB-220. And that's why the KB-220 is such a powerful uh, premium tank, because it's the opposite armor profile of a KB-1, but they look identical. Yeah. So, so shoot the turret is what I heard, right, for the 220? Someone was telling yes, me in that comment, the shoot the turret. turret. Is the weaker part of, of that tank, yeah. The 220 Unless is you awesome. get like me and get his butt <laughs> the entire time, and then you're good to go. Yeah. That's because it's got that tier 7 haul, right? It's like the KB-3 isn't it? Good to go, yeah, good to is. go. That always reminds Chassis. me of Cosmic Harry. He always says that. Good to go, good to go. The big thing is that the game trains you on the KB-1 to aim for the KB-1 hull. And you see a tank that looks like a KB-1, so you aim for the hull. And people yeah. will spend a lot of time just wasting their rounds on you that way. I'm going to be honest. I mean, normally I in the round panzer, when I see a KV-1, I just load a prem round. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. But I had a game yesterday, 5,000 damage blocked in a tier 5 game. Oh, oh my god. Dibs on this other already. Gotta get that top gun. <laughs> that artillery. Oh <laughs> uh, well, I mean, if you want, if you want to, if you call dibs, then it's not really a top gun, you know. It's a kind of scrub gun. Oh, yeah, that's seriously. True. <laughs> Shame. <laughs> Shame. <laughs> Churchill. You can. So how much damage you guys think I can do this Churchill coming from top speed down this hill here? Uh, oh, you got oh, oh the eyes behind you going for you as well. I reckon a hundred and twenty. I reckon you can maybe. Yeah, I don't know. Flat ground, hundred fifty maybe. Depending on crew and equipment. He's going away from oh. me as well. Now he's playing sensibly. He's like, oh, this wasn't as easy as I thought it might be. And you've got your ammo damaged. Hey, there you ah, go. There you nice. Go. Oh, it wow. went. he did one more damage. One more damage. <laughs> Love me. Worth in the end of the day there. Good top gun. Solid. How many platoon kills did we get in that round? Six, All nine, ten, twelve. Con crucial contribution. GG. Yeah, exactly 12. We can't really pat ourselves on the back for that. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe slightly more so than the tier 1 game that we just did. <laughs> How did I make so little money? Was I accidentally firing? Oh, premium consumables, probably. We got a crucial. crucial. We did, and top 5. But I mean, we had very, very nice matchmaking there as well. Um, oh, someone's requesting there. Lammy in the Death Star. <laughs> fancy another tier 10? I'm off for that. Yeah, I've got, tier a, 10 I've got again. a few different tier tens I can roll out in. Um, I'll take that. Maybe should I say the batch again, or should I go TD? What's everyone else think you're going to play for go tier ten? Because I guess we could go for some crazy like. Oh, maybe I don't know. Should we go like the waffle? Oh, yeah. Let's just go crazy. TDs. Everyone got a tier ten TD. Uh. It's <laughs> it's okay if you don't. We won't think of you any I less. Do. I won't be less of a man. To... I'm going to play something different, though. Okay, uh, that's fine. That's don't fine. think any less of me. I'm going <laughs> to play one of my favorite tanks here. Okay. Oh, interesting. Oh, well, look at that. Um, okay, now. What, do we, should we count them down? Oh, well, fuck it, we'll count them down. You know, it's Christmas. It's Christmas. We'll count them down. Merry Christmas. You get a five second countdown. Everyone. You get an extra long wait for the first second though, because I'm feeling that Christmas. Four, three, two, one. <laughs> two, one. 